you had your hand up. We have callers, no, no one from the panel, we have callers itself saying that don't just blame the BJP. Every successive government has been corrupt. They have only wanted to make money when it comes to developing urban infrastructure in Bangalore. And the Babus have been indifferent. And this is how the story has been going on for the last 20 years, because of which we are yeah, seeing I, what we are seeing today. I listened to most of the people what they spoke now. The first thing I would like to tell you, madam, hmm. Uh, uh, the minister in charge of revenue department in Karnataka state, whatever he state, is a blended lies. He's trying to fool the people of the country, which is not acceptable. Mm. Today, I'm telling you, BBMP has become mere collection center of taxes mm. and become a corruption center for the entire identity. Bangalore is sinking today. Today, BJP is now in the, in the governance, not only for six months. They are in governance for the past three and a half years. Three and a half years' time, they have spent more than uh, more than 3,200 rupees for strong water drains cleaning. Whatever Srikant said, I completely agree with it because that much amount has been spent now. And um, Bangalore has got a budget of 10,000 crores. 8,000 crores has been given by the government of Karnataka on taxpayers' revenue to the Bangalore development. Yes. And the court is every time summoning the corporation commissioner, telling him to look at the roads and also asking for a statement by making a statement by a judge, mm. saying that the prime minister or, or the president depender should he be in his visit Bangalore to make the roads all right. The roads conditions are bad, drain conditions are bad, storm, red, storm water drain conditions are bad, it's all completely broken up and governance is nothing is there. They are only busy with all the polarization of politics in the name of halal cut, jatka cut mm. or savarkar or something else which is not acceptable at all. Mm. People of Bangalore are looking forward for a better development because Bangalore is one of the fastest growing dynamic city in the world. But the they were looking for looking good development Bangalore. and good urban infrastructure yeah. even let when me. your government was in power, Congress no, JDS. Let me, let me, let me tell you, madam, this was not... This was is not this the first the time we are seeing pictures like this come from Bangalore? No, 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 no. this is not... These this pictures have come out... Today. In the history of Karnataka... No, 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 sir. No, no, don't when go back Sidramaya into history there, of Karnataka, ma sir. Let me complete it. When, let, let me complete it. When Sidramaya was, the government was came to power, you would have noticed the BMTC workshops were flooded with five feet of water inside the workshop. What we did, I was the chairman of uh, uh, Bangalore, uh, Bangalore BMTC at that time. What we did, we made a parallel Nala so that the no water comes into the uh, BMTC workshops or to the uh, to the uh, Shantinagar area. Mm. We did that thing, we're spending 15, 15 crores there, and we did it, today it's not flooding there in Shantinagar. We have done something, and when, when Sidramaya was there, storm water drains were completely, we have, we have tried to evacuate uh, all the encroachment, and the, by the time we lost the government. The government which came in power after that is BJP government. Mm -hmm. BJP government is held responsible for this because in power today. They are answerable to the Kalappa. people of Bangalore. Today, drains are not there. And we also the allegation of the contractors who are maintaining the Bangalore city and the strong budgeted contractors are complaining the Prime Minister for 40% commission. Uh -huh. No action is being taken today. What more let in... Uh, yeah, yeah, I uh, should come in, please. Mr. Mohan yeah, Krishna, I don't have too much time on this debate. It is 45 already and we have some speakers who have not spoken. But I will give you 10 seconds to respond, after which I'll go to Mr. Kalappa. Today I'm telling you, it is BJP is responsible for all this thing. It's not political game. As a citizen of Bangalore, I'm telling you, this is not acceptable to Bangalore. B no, BJP is not alone responsible, but I will let...